Okay, 2.38 in the morning, and I've already recorded Luna Game 1 and 2. Time to move on to Luna Game 3. So, here we go. Another blind playthrough. I've not seen any videos of this, nor have I read anything on it. It's totally blind. Just see what happens, and see if I get scared, the sh and see if I get absolutely scared again. Um... This is a marathon now! You have to run! <laughs> Music's freaking awesome. Wait... Everything's getting darker. At least the terrain is not cracking. Blacked out house, 2.40 in the morning. I'm playing Luna game. Someone showed me... Uh, oh, the character just flickered there. Somebody on Oat actually just showed me um, a link to um, Story of the Blank Flanks. I played like five minutes of it, but I got stuck at one point. So I was like, oh, whatever. I'll finish it later after I do my Luna game recordings. Do, do. Oh. <laughs> Different tempo change I wasn't expecting. Why is it so dark now? Another Luna flicker. This is really freaking boring. Obviously, it's gonna change at some point, but whatever. Okay, I guess that was just the music looping there. Still the same terrain. Let's see if changing that up does anything. Another character flicker. Wait, music's detuning. Should I call this G Sharp Major? I have no damn clue. Holy crap, that's detuned. <laughs> Chaos. I detuned my bass to E flat and struck a chord. I'm sorry, world. Reference to the J J Japan tsunamis. <laughs> DTF fans only know that, and holy crap, that is detuned. Herder <laughs> through the fire flames! The holy crap. Just the music is detuned to almost nothing. Really, really. Good. Whoa, okay. And what happened with the background? It. Off. What the hell? <laughs> Very ominous music now. It's still the same. Uh, another pit jump. No burst of static. Thank you for that. God damn, why do you have to run for so long? Character flicker. Oh, I don't understand why those are there. Nothing is freaking changing. And this is pretty easy for blind playthrough. Some shit's going down. Maybe the pits are supposed to progress to a size so big that you cannot jump over them? Maybe... I don't know. Maybe something's chasing after you. Okay, this is getting boring again. However, I'm still kinda shaky. I'm convinced the pits are getting wider and wider. And once you fall down them, then you lose the game. I'm 
I'm so curious what the hell that static was at first. Wait a minute. Is Luna getting smaller? Luna is getting smaller. Maybe that's just my eyes screwing with me. I know Luna is freaking smaller. She like shrunk to like two thirds of her size. And is getting smaller. This is one freaking determined pony. Oh, I see what the flickers are about. It's when the terrain, like, loops over. So, and, uh, Luna flickers because of it. Let's <clears throat> just try walking for a bit. Wait a minute, the screen's... the screen was panning. Maybe this is my vision messing with me. Oh no, I'm pretty sure it's my eyes. It's like... Oh, the screen is rotating or something like that. Am I supposed to fall down these freaking holes? Let's go backwards. God, this is gonna eat up so much recording time. I hope I don't get another blast of static to the face. This is even quieter than usual. This is purely reminding me of East Hastings by Godspeed You Black Emperor. Oh shit! Ah! What the fuck? I guess you were supposed to fall down those pits. Ah! Shit! That was a good scare! Uh, okay then. Uh, uh, Luna Game 3. Apparently you're supposed to fall down the pits. And get the crap scared out of you. Okay then. See you guys later.